Yes, sir. Well, I know you uh, tried to go a couple of days ago. How did it feel tonight? Felt pretty good. Felt a lot better than uh, two, three days ago where I, I just felt I couldn't play. But today I felt like the the pain wasn't high enough for me to not be able to play. So that was that was, that was good. I know uh, the first period was a little frustrating, and you guys came back out in the second. Um, you know, give us what what you thought maybe was was a little bit slow in the first. Well, we just like I think we just. Uh, kept the puck too much uh, on the sides instead of going forward and I think we changed that for the second and I, th I felt like it we played a lot better and started creating a little more because we were a little slow in the first and kind of played into their hands the first period. What's it like uh, being partnered up with Jordan Spence? Uh, obviously he can do a lot of different things with the puck. Yeah well it's unreal it's a pleasure he's a amazing player so I just try to give him the puck as much as I can because I know good things will happen. Haven't been many games this season where the team's been kept off the board for as long as, as tonight until finally finding the breakthrough. What are some things that you can take away from this one moving into a quick game in just a couple days? Well, to not get frustrated because I felt like we maybe got a little frustrated. Uh, I think that's a, a lesson we need to take with us because it's going to happen other times during games that we're creating chances but we're not scoring just to stuck with it I think it's the most important lesson from today what's it like playing in front of Cal I know you've done it before uh, at a different level but uh, I mean he's come down here and it seems like he's making really a lot of big saves yeah well he's keeping us in every game like we really give him some tough looks but he's handling them so well and we all know he's an unbelievable goal keeper so it, I'm really happy for him to to make some really nice saves is it knowing that it's a quick turnaround? You're going to play against Tucson, almost more like an NHL schedule this week. Is that a good thing to, to try to focus on the next game? It's coming up quick. Yeah, I think it's a good thing because then you kind of forget this one pretty fast instead of like having a week of practice and kind of kind of in the back of your head for a couple of days. So it's nice to leave this one and get to the next one. I know Tucson's physical tonight was physical. You know what for you guys. It, when you when you get into a physical game like that, it seems like guys have been stepping up. Is that kind of you know you you're seeing a response a little bit there? Yeah, well, I think we've been responding a lot during the year when guys are stepping up and everything. I think we have a really tight group, and I think that helps that everyone take care of each other. No one gets left alone out there, and I think you can really see it on the ice. There's been a couple of times this year um, where even if it isn't somebody out with an injury or not in the lineup or maybe in the penalty box um, that usually can ramp up the physicality? Do you guys feel more responsibility to take that upon yourselves and maybe you guys aren't necessarily the ones who typically do that? Yeah, well, I think everyone been chipping in this year with a little physicality. It's always good because American Hockey League is a physical league and so I think it's good we've been responding with physicality and that's, I think that's been good from us.